In a recent exclusive interview, Lee Min Ho shared deep insights into his role in Pachinko Season 2, offering fans a closer look at some of the most memorable scenes and the complex emotions tied to his character, Ko Hansu. One of the highlights of the conversation was when he delved into a particularly heartwarming scene where Ko Hansu teaches Sanja, portrayed by Kim Min Ha, how to drive. Set in the tranquil surroundings of a paddy field in Japan, this driving lesson is far from just an instructional moment, it's layered with romantic tension and emotional depth. The simplicity of the scene contrasts with the complexity of the emotions involved, creating a beautifully poignant moment between Ko Hansu and Sanja. This seemingly ordinary act reveals much about their relationship and their social standing. The paddy field setting itself is symbolic, a quiet and secluded place that allows the characters to let their guard down. The contrast between the sprawling open field and the intensity of their unspoken feelings adds to the richness of the scene. Ko Hansu, a successful businessman, and Sanja, a woman from humble beginnings, come from two very different worlds. This driving lesson subtly underscores the stark hierarchical and social differences that separate them. Yet, in this moment, the divide seems to shrink, allowing them to connect in a way that transcends their circumstances. It's fascinating to see how a simple act like teaching someone to drive can carry such emotional weight. In many ways, it's not just about learning a skill, it's about Ko Hansu trying to bridge the gap between their worlds, trying to insert himself into Sanja's life despite the barriers that exist between them. Reflecting on the scene, Lee Min Ho revealed that it portrays the complex nature of the relationship between Ko Hansu and Sanja. The scene, he explains, isn't just about teaching, it's about the intimacy of the moment, the silent communication that passes between them as they navigate not just the car, but their relationship. Ko Hansu, always composed and in control, shows a softer, more vulnerable side in this scene. It's moments like these that reveal the layers of his character. As an actor, Lee Min Ho captures the subtle shifts in emotion that make the scene so moving. The chemistry between him and Kim Min Ha brings these intricate dynamics to life, making this scene one of the most memorable in the series. Interestingly, during the interview, Lee Min Ho was asked if he had ever taught someone to drive in real life. He responded with a smile, sharing that he once taught a younger friend, or Dong Sing, how to drive. The memory brought a sense of warmth to the conversation as he fondly recalled the experience. He also mentioned that he had taught someone to ski, revealing that he enjoys being part of someone's learning process. These experiences, he explained, are meaningful to him because they involve being present during someone's first moments, something he finds incredibly special. It's clear from his tone that these memories hold a sentimental value for him, much like Ko Hansu's attempts to create lasting memories with Sanja, Lee Min Ho went on to draw a connection between his real-life experiences and the driving lesson seen in Pachinko. He shared that teaching someone something for the first time is always significant, as it creates a bond and a memory that lasts. In the same way, Ko Hansu's act of teaching Sanja to drive is more than just a lesson, it's his way of trying to create a shared experience with her, to carve out a moment in time that is just theirs. It's a beautifully subtle way of showing his affection for her, even if he can't express it outright. The unresolved romantic tension between Ko Hansu and Sanja is palpable in this scene, and Lee Min Ho captures that tension with remarkable sensitivity. His performance allows the audience to feel the weight of their emotions, even when the characters themselves are holding back. When asked about his favorite romantic moment between Ko Hansu and Sanja, Lee Min Ho reflected on a scene from season 1 that still stands out to him as the most memorable. He fondly recalled a moment when Ko Hansu and Sanja exchanged glances in a crowded marketplace. It was a brief, almost fleeting moment. But the intensity of the gaze they shared spoke volumes about the feelings bubbling beneath the surface. Lee Min Ho explained that this scene was significant because it marked a turning point in their relationship. Up until that moment, their interactions had been filled with tension and uncertainty, but the glance they exchanged in the marketplace was a moment of recognition, an acknowledgement of the connection between them, even if it couldn't be fully acted upon. It's these kinds of moments that make Pachinko such a compelling watch, the romance is often quiet, understated, but undeniably powerful, season 2 of Pachinko doesn't feature as many overtly romantic scenes between Ko Hansu and Sanja. But the underlying tension remains. Their relationship is complex and fraught with conflicting emotions, and this is reflected in the way they interact with one another. Lee Min Ho pointed out that the desperation in their interactions, whether it's a call for help or a dismissive, arrogant remark, reveals the depth of their feelings for one another. They are constantly pulling away from and being drawn back to each other, creating a dynamic that is as heartbreaking as it is compelling. 
Their love story is not one of smooth, easy romance, it's messy, complicated, and full of unresolved feelings, which makes it all the more real. Lee Min Ho highlighted that even the smallest moments between Ko Hansu and Sunja hold deeper meaning. The driving lesson, for example, is not just about learning to drive, it's a metaphor for the power dynamics at play in their relationship. Ko Hansu, as the one in control, is trying to guide Sunja, to bring her into his world. But Sanja, independent and strong-willed, is not easily swayed. This push and pull is what makes their relationship so fascinating to watch. The driving scene, Lee Minho explained, is also symbolic of the social gap between them. Ko Hansu, with all his wealth and power, is trying to bridge that gap, but it's not something that can be easily overcome. Yet, in that moment, they are just two people, sharing a quiet, intimate experience, reflecting on his own experiences teaching others. Li Minho couldn't help but smile as he recounted the joy and satisfaction he felt in being part of someone's firsts. It's these personal connections that resonate with him, both in real life and in his portrayal of Ko Hansu. The actor shared that teaching someone to drive or ski is not just about imparting knowledge, it's about the bond that forms in those moments. His performance in Pachinko mirrors this sentiment, as Ko Hansu's attempts to be part of Sanja's life are driven by his desire to create shared memories even if their circumstances make it difficult for them to be together. As Pachinko season 2 airs on Apple TV, viewers are eager to see how the relationship between Ko Hansu and Sunja continues to evolve. Lee Minho's portrayal of Ko Hansu is marked by a delicate balance of strength and vulnerability, and this is especially evident in his scenes with Kim Min Ha. The emotional complexity of their relationship is what drives the core of the show, and fans are captivated by the subtle, nuanced moments that reveal the depth of their feelings for one another. Each glance, each word exchanged, carries weight, and it's these moments of quiet intensity that make Pachinko such a powerful story of love, loss, and longing. The driving lesson scene is a standout moment in season 2, not just because of its romantic undertones, but because it reveals so much about Ko Hansu's character. Lee Minho's performance in this scene is layered with emotion. Showing both Ko Hansu's desire to be close to Sanja and his frustration at the barriers between them. It's a beautifully crafted moment that speaks to the heart of their relationship, filled with both affection and distance, connection and separation. This balance of tension and tenderness is what makes their love story so compelling and heartbreaking at the same time. As the season progresses, viewers will undoubtedly be drawn deeper into the complexities of Ko Hansu and Sanja's relationship. While their romance is far from traditional, it is filled with moments of quiet beauty, where even the smallest gestures carry enormous emotional weight. Lee Minho's reflections on these moments in the interview offer a deeper understanding of his character and the intricate dynamics that make Pachinko such an unforgettable series. The subtle, non-obvious moments of romance between Ko Hansu and Sanja are what drive the emotional core of the show, and it's these moments that continue to resonate with audiences long after the credits roll.